Good morning, beautiful people. What we got today is a JLG 1930 ES. And what I'm gonna do with y'all today is I'm pretty much just gonna go over this handheld analyzer here that I got hooked up, plugged in. I'll show you some simple steps and basic information that's in here that might be useful for y'all. So this is your home screen. So pretty much what you got here is menu, help, press enter. So pretty self-explanatory, you press enter, everything okay no further problems so you hit enter one more time and it gives you a log of your previous fault codes that the scissor lift has had so here as you see one it's your regular power cycle it's just your e-stop cycle and through that it's not an issue second one so this scissor lift here by the log there's been a issue with the brake as it reads the 33 code left brake open circuit so somebody did something to this unit with the brake. Uh, another one, as you see here, log three. Function locked out. And through four, you see a log of just pretty much everything that's um, been done to this machine or the faults that this machine has thrown in the past couple of days. So we'll go back to the home screens here. So we'll go ahead and hit escape one more time and now we're back to menu. So this is your menu screen. So when you hit a right arrow, you'll see to the right, it sends you over to diagnostics. One more time, system test. Access level two, personalities, and machine setups. Back to normal. So uh, in diagnostics, pretty much if you scroll through, uh, you can see stuff with your platform, your ground, your traction, your pump, your system, elevation sensor, and your valves, and uh, your charger, how much it's putting out. And it can actually run a test throughout its whole system uh, on itself and let you know that everything on it is good. Shows you the version that you have. Uh, that's one option. Another one here is the system test, and that's the test that I'm telling you that it'll self-run by itself. Uh, we have access level two, and this is usually what you want to go into to change any settings on it. So what you do here on access level two, you press enter, and you type in your code, which is three, three, two, seven, one, and then it brings you to access level one. Now, access level two is there, so you can get into the personalities and the machine setups of this machine. This is the menu text you to after you put your code. Personalities, machine setup, calibrations. And then diagnostics, we checked it. So your personality on it, you have your drive, your lift, your steer, your accelerator, your grounding, back to your drive. And what you can do here is you can actually change the speed on the machine, which uh, it's not advised unless it's been checked by a qualified JLG uh, mechanic. So lift, same thing, you can change the speed on the lift. Uh, steer, you can change how fast it steers. Uh, so it's pretty, some pretty nice and neat stuff here with this analyzer. Uh, here's your machine setup, 1930S, which is your model. And uh, you can actually change the model on it, which is pretty interesting. Obviously, you put 26 foot, it will not go up 26 foot, but it will mess up uh, the program inside the computer. So you will have to recalibrate and put it back to a 19. So um, we won't mess with that. Pretty much simple, basic stuff. Uh, throughout the videos, you'll see me come into this and work it with y'all. Uh, but right now, the only thing I really wanted to show you was the access level one. Well, access level two was getting in, which is your code. Three, three, two, seven, one. And here you can calibrate your machine, change the settings on it. Uh, again, if you have any problems or issues, go ahead and send me a, a comment down and uh we'll figure it out we'll check it out um uh, like i said i don't advise you changing anything on the settings unless you know what you're doing um other than that other than that simple to you know tips uh that you might want to use here when you have this analyzer if you ever do buy one uh but as always don't forget to like comment and subscribe and uh, write down some kind of videos that y'all want might want to see uh, something for more that y'all might want to know about. Y'all have a great day. Bless ya.